indeed uh, we enter into a contract with Regent University to build this edifice for them. And uh, we duly did what we were su supposed to do. Uh, we were supposed to build this edifice and uh, give them one year grace period, which we did. So they were supposed to pay us 17th April 2018. And uh, immediate the time due, we requested for payment because we follow up with them to give us payment as the project was ongoing by the Chancellor, by then uh, Professor Emmanuel Reverend Kinsley Labi has told us that, that immediately we finish the project, we are going to be paid. Mind you, the amount involved uh, 1.2 million, uh, $1 million dollars and 2.1 million Ghana cities is quite a huge amount. So we, the commitment that we made. So we thought uh, we could uh, achieve the payment immediately after the, 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 the grace period is over. Unfortunately, that thing didn't come on. So uh, as we keep on pushing for the payment, we saw that the university is not ready to pay. So we pursue this matter to uh, commercial high court. Duly, the commercial high court found sense in what we are saying, and they granted us. Uh, 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 we won the case. To put it short, we won the case, and uh, the case we won. They gave them payment plan. We all agreed, which the uh, the president, uh, uh, Reverend Chris, uh, Professor Quincy Lilabi, uh, uh, endorsed it, and his vice, uh, Kwabena Amonu, endorsed it. So it became uh, a judgment for all of us to follow the payment. And my brothers, as we speak, they, they couldn't pay. They only pay once. So it, it tells you, uh, the, much as we pursue them, that look, even though uh, uh, we know we gave them all the opportunities to pay, but we saw that they are not paying. So we went back to the court, and the court granted us to execute the, the court order.